affect my credit because I'm closing out the Chime credit card that I originally set it up on. Mm -hmm. And so I change it to my Bank of America card. Yeah. Right? And so uh, it keeps, every time I order the Uber, it goes right to the Chime one, even though that I've switched it. Uh -huh. It keeps defaulting back to the original one I set it up with. I'm wondering if I should remove the app and then re... You know, I don't know. Oh, for cry. Are you fucking kidding? Hello? 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 Terrible, Harriet. If you call me one more time, I'm going to report you to the Better Business Bureau. Right, boy, I'm telling you, it's ridiculous. Man. Looks like many people are giving you troubles. <laughs> huh? <laughs> many people are giving you troubles. No, just Uber and that guy. Uber and There's that still guy. Still 10,000 other people, and they're doing all right. They're doing all right. How was the restaurant? How was the food? You know, I wasn't, uh, I, I was uh, surprised. It was actually better than I thought it was going to be. Oh, yeah? Yep. What did you like about the it? women weren't too good. Women weren't too no, good? No, but the food was pretty decent. Nice. So what kind of women do you like? Uh, not those skanky whores. No, those skanky whores. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> so what kind do you like? I like, like? A high, I like a high class, nice woman like that. Mm-hmm. Nice. Yeah, not that kind. Not that kind. <laughs> you like nice women. So you, you top guy or bottom guy, if you don't mind me asking? Uh, no, I'm a top guy. <laughs> oh, you're the top guy. <laughs> yeah. That's what's up. That's what's up. You know? I'm a, better, I'm a, you better watch out for your life guy. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you still got that energy, huh? <laughs> oh, yeah. I can feel it. You're energetic still. And you are young, too. I'm 60 you're... years old now. What? Yeah. You look so young. Thank you. You look young. You got that young energy, man. Still making it, still moving. Oh. I was, I was in the uh, federal penitentiary for ten years. Whoa! Yeah, falsely incarcerated. Okay. They finally figured out and let me out finally after ten years of fighting. <laughs> oh, okay. How how was that? Terrible. Did you, did you enjoy it? Good women there? No, not good women. No, there's no women there. <laughs> all guys. Yeah. Is there any bad incident happened since there are all guys? All kinds of bad incidents. People get killed, choked, beaten. Whoa. Stab, okay. paste, Whoa. smash. <laughs> well, like, is it true if you drop the soap, nah. you're done? <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> huh? No. 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 I, you know, I, maybe, maybe years and years and years ago, but when I went in 10 years ago, there was none of that. I mean, the only time you see that was you were willing to do it. <laughs> yeah. And I didn't see any... Uh, like that, but I was only in um, the camp and uh, the low area, so I wasn't in the high, high areas like on TV. Oh, okay. Like, you know. well, yeah, I didn't you know. I was just, uh, you know, um, you never know what happens yeah. in there, you know? So what were you in for, if you don't mind me asking? They call it, it's a vicarious crime. My chief financial officer stole money, so being the chief executive officer, then oh. I get, I have to do time as well. Oh, you were CEO? Yeah. Oh, nice. What what company? It was called the company uh, Realty Internationals Opportunities. We were developing. I was developing a city. Okay. In here, a master or in... urban developer. It's called the. Uh, it's called the um, uh, urban master plans, mm -hmm. and then you would develop the city. So, what do you do now, if you don't mind me asking? Well, now that I'm out, I I uh, uh, just got a job here at. Um, Thrive at the mm -hmm. medical center, mm -hmm. and I was doing that, and I said, you know what, I'm not going to do that anymore. Yeah. So I just uh, stopped doing that, and just got another job over here at Pisons because okay. I only want to work three days a week. Mm -hmm. so I work 12 hours a day, three days a week, and the other four days I do construction. Okay. So. Uh, so you work remodeling, in like I'm doing a bathroom in DeKalb. Okay. I'm doing a basement in Woodstock. Nice. So I just take the train out there and just. Uh, place to do it. I'm doing a uh, uh, garage in Lyle. So you are doing it yourself yeah. or? Yeah, just by myself. Pretty soon maybe I'll get some help, but right now I'm just, like I say, oh, okay. thank goodness I still got enough energy I can do it myself. 
Yeah, no, no, there is I nothing wrong. 12, 15 hours. Yeah, that's amazing. Uh, you know, you get to do things that you still like and uh, the other side as well, you know. But no, I was going to ask how much experience you have in remodeling and stuff. In what? In the remodeling and stuff. Like, what, uh, what I was going to. Remodeling. Oh, yeah, uh, tremendous. Uh, 30. Uh, let's see, it'll be you know, because I have a property. Years. I have a property as well myself. Mm -hmm. You want to uh, fix it up and and sell it for a profit? Uh, that's one thing. But I already own a property, mm -hmm. one in suburb. I was gonna say, I wanted to build like another floor. Uh huh. You know. So what's it all depends on your foundation. I think it's possible because the the next uh, right next to me, both of the buildings have uh, did extensions. To mm -hmm. their building. Oh, they did it already. Yeah, they did it oh, already. That's possible. Probably so, sometimes when they do that track building, if it's not custom home, if it wasn't a custom home from the beginning, it's called track building. Like yeah. these, these are all track. Okay. Yeah. So yeah. Does, no. You know, they're cookie cutters. They do no. the same thing here. Do the next one, same thing. Next one, same thing. You know what I mean? So yeah. Uh, if the two neighbors did it, that most likely you could do it too. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Uh, so I wanted to just know how much it cost and uh, um, what things that I have to do to you know take another step something like that the first thing you're gonna have to do is you're gonna have to get an architect because you have to that's a major situation you're gonna have to get uh, approved by the city okay um, they're gonna look at the plans that's what they will approve look so I have to hire an architect yeah so you're gonna architect You'll create the plans, make sure that it's architecturally sound, what you're intending to do. Okay. And then the city will uh, look at it and say, okay, yeah, well, this is all right. He's got, you know, it's structurally sound and um, he's got an architect that signed, uh -huh. you know, to it. And uh, then they will approve it. And then from there you get your bond. You got to get your, you know, so that you're going to make sure that you go through with the deal. Yeah. And then I'll tell you. Why? What, what happened with the time no, card? No, uh, uh, the worst service, it never works properly. Right now, I'm trying to put money on the card and saying it's declined. Oh. What do you mean? How could it be declined? I'm depositing. <laughs> Probably they are thinking that you are taking money. He, he showed me. He said, here, deposit, boom, it's declined. He says, this oh. card, you know what it came up on the computer? Oh. This card cannot be sold. What the hell do you mean? Did you bought the card? No, that's what I'm saying. What kind of a answer is that you put on there? This card Pro cannot Probably be. they closed your card. No, I just looked at it. It fell. I just looked at it on the app. That's what took so long. I had to bring it up on the app. Because I was trying to close it out, but there's still a $1.25 on it. Mm -hmm. But the thing is, is some of the old things are still tied to it, like this Uber. Oh, okay. So how long have you been this been in this area? Uh, since February 10th when I got out. Oh, nice. How'd you like so far? Well, my brother's lived here his whole life, so I've I've been here in this woods in this uh, Woodstocks where I normally live that my whole life. But mm -hmm. my brother's been here his whole life, so. So how long were you in for? Ten years. Ten years. How much things change? Well, everything prices have exactly doubled. Everything's doubled. Doubled prices since I've been in ten years. Everything's exactly doubled. Oh. Everything. How it feels even, like even eating at McDonald's doubled. Yeah. How it feels like to be out. Terrible. I want to go back. Why do you want to go back? Uh, maybe just kill somebody so I can go back for <laughs> ten years. <laughs> no. Uh, it feels great, but I never should have been in the first place. Yes, yes, yes. But uh, you know. No, we, but why do you want to go... put that behind and just move on? That's all. Keep why building. do you want to go back in? No, I'm just fucking with you. Oh, okay, I okay. I want to go back. All righty. I, I thought you were you being fun. Work as hard as possible to make, you know. Yeah. Oh, I was going to say. Can, millions. Yeah, yes, sir. I was going to say, uh, can I get your contact number so I can uh, um, ask you questions about the property there? Sure. You know? You want to take it down? I don't have a business card or once, anything. Once we, once we get over there, okay. we can talk more, you know? Yeah, but uh, yes, besides that. Yeah, I've been doing it ever since I was, uh, I incorporated when I was 17, been self-employed for 32 years. Oh, so you never, so, you've been working for 
for myself for 32 years and then this happened. Once we went to a corporation and then, uh, you know, had different officers, mm -hmm. you know, but it was been a process. It, it, it started with one house and then we were local, statewide, nationwide, and then international. Over a process of third people, how did you do? How did you do? Yeah, it, was, it took 32 years. It wasn't that like it was overnight. Yes, it took 32 years. But when I was 17, I incorporated and I never looked back. Just yeah. like you say, I've always had a lot of energy and just keep working. Keep working. Is that's the one thing that a lot of people forget? You know, yep. the work part. You gotta work hard. They, everybody wants to make money overnight. Everybody wants to be a millionaire overnight, you know, overnight, but they don't want to put in the work. I mean, there's a lot of ways to be a millionaire, and it's definitely, definitely possible. I uh, will tell that to anybody, but you've got to know what you are going to do to get it. What is your plan? That's the, the biggest thing that I've seen how people fail is they have no plan. Yep. Oh, I want to be a millionaire. Okay, well, how do you intend to get it? What's your plan? What's point A? What's point B? What's point X, Y, Z? You don't have that. Yeah. Everybody only thinks that, oh, I'm going to make a million. Right. They don't. For, they forget the process and uh, forget to love and profit. It has to be specific oh, plan. With process. Like my, I just finished my business plan now to, to make uh, $100 million this mm -hmm. time. So, I mean, but it's a 50-page plan, an outline oh. for myself. Yeah. Right now, you know, I have to start with nothing again. Yes. So that's where I'm at. You'll be able to do it. The next house. Very next house. Oh. Yes, this one. Alrighty. There you go.